So I think we can say with the benefit of hindsight that Galileo, yes, he was ultimately right. But this goes back to the question about whether science is about reason and evidence. And it seems to me in this case, if we want to argue that science is about reason and evidence, the Catholic Church had reason and evidence on its side. And in terms of the science of the day, Galileo was clearly wrong in the claims he made. Now, as I say, with the benefit of hindsight, we know that Galileo turned out to be right. But apart from the fact that, yes, the church was wrong, it was certainly imprudent to make a point of this. We understand why they made a point of it because of the context of the Protestant Reformation, uh, but it was probably unwise. And I think I would hope that, that a lesson has, has been learnt there. But there's also something interesting in this about the nature of science, and that is that people who make uh, people who make speculations that go well beyond the evidence often turn out to be right, and that science is not simply a matter of of of, of you know basing your view on the available evidence. It often entails a large step beyond that, and that's what Galileo shows us that he was prepared to go beyond the evidence, whereas the church was not.